First Horn 5 forecast, certified most accurate by weather rate. It is quite a nice Saturday out so far, and it should stay that way for just about everybody as we head throughout the rest of the day. And then tomorrow we do have some rain chances, so that's what we're talking about coming up. Let's start with a look at our temperatures outside. Right now, though, conditions are pretty nice. Temperatures in those mid to upper 60s for most of us. We do have a couple 50s still holding on to the map there. We're going to watch those temperatures start to climb as we head throughout the day. Here's a look at your first one five pinpoint Doppler live from MBS. All is quiet out there. Now, actually, you know, you you do see a couple of these green spots here on the map, but these green spots are actually wind farms that are showing up on radar this morning near Alma and just north of Mount Pleasant there. It doesn't happen all the time, but sometimes in the early morning hours uh, when we have really stable conditions in the atmosphere, you can see the wind farms on the radar. Here's a look at the forecast up to the north, though. We do have temperatures, again, starting out in the 60s, eventually climbing to about 81, 82 degrees for most of us, and you're also going to be watching those rain chances increase as we get into the afternoon with the variable clouds and sun. Now this rain chance, I want to make this clear that it's a very small rain chance for us and almost everybody is going to be dry. We're going to have a very isolated shower chance, mostly north of US 10. So for our northern counties, almost everybody will be dry until we get into the overnight hours. We're going to start picking up another chance for some of those showers. Moving down to the south, though, a, a similar story, less chance for that rain, especially during the afternoon. We'll pick the rain chance back up as we get closer to midnight. You're also going to be in and out of the clouds and sun there for us for most of the day. Temperatures in those low 80s, same off to the thumb, maybe a degree or two cooler. You've got again the mix between the clouds and sun rain chances, mostly on the light side here for us, but they will be increasing as we get into earlier tomorrow morning. Same across the south here again. The sun now, but we're going to be picking up a little bit more of the cloud cover, but even then we'll be in and out of the clouds and sun for us today. Out there on the water for today, inner bay, outer bay temperatures in the 70s. Waves really, I mean, we're not looking at any issue from the waves today. Winds out of the southwest. And as we get out into the more open water, northeast, lower peninsula and the thumb, Temperatures, these air temperatures in the 60s, but still we're looking at those nice conditions out there on the water. For the hour by hour, we've got the clouds and sun for us today. A little bit more cloud cover moving in later into the afternoon with a small chance for an isolated shower, mostly off to the north. We're going to keep a close eye on that, but again, it's just a town or two. Most people should stay dry. That'll change, though, as we get into the overnight hours. This is midnight tonight. You're, wa you're looking here at US 127, where we've got more shower chances moving in as we get into to the later morning hours, really ramping up those rain chances as we get into Sunday morning with a small break Sunday afternoon. Here's what that seven day looks like. Also take a note at our temperatures throughout this seven day, heating up to 85 on Wednesday, cooling down for the start of fall into 70 with 65 on Friday.